Okay, okay. So uh, I want to thank everyone and uh, Don, Trolls, the rest of the uh, Gauntlet crew for having me out here again to give an award. But, uh, you know, I've never been to an award show where I got called a nerd, you know? I mean, I'm like, damn, well, we're all nerds, right? And if we're not, I guess that's why we get paid. I mean, I don't know. But besides that, you know, and honestly, it's all speaking, I'm very happy that there's a groom filled with people here that have a passion for making games that actually want to go out there, either start their own studios or join existing studios, and hell, maybe even become the next it of the future. I mean, what I've seen in the past, say, 12 months of being able to assist and work with you guys and, you know, sit back and track the progress of this school is a bunch of passionate people, guys, girls, and in between, and, uh, you know, Hell, I don't care. I mean, the thing, what it comes down to is that you're seeing amazing games. I'm um, seeing from fairy tales to games about moral conflict. I mean, I would have never thought I would see fairy tales and then a game that teaches you about moral choices. But that's cool. That's games. This is how it's supposed to be. I mean, at the same time, not everyone understands our industry. And at the same time, most people just really enjoy what we're doing. But I think one of the key things you guys got to remember here more than anything else is John came up here and said four years ago he was a student, now he owns his own company. I mean, seven years ago, I was in a house with four guys in 70 square meters. That's what it takes to basically make your dream come true. That is the passion, the passion that each and every one of you have inside of your heart in order to say, hell, I'm gonna make a game. Yes, mom and dad, I'm gonna make games. I may not get paid much and may eat a bunch of noodles that are dried and don't taste good, but you know what? I'm gonna make a damn game and I'm gonna make it and whether or not my girlfriend understands or my boyfriend understands, which my girlfriend understands, you know. <laughs> it basically comes down to one of these things that uh, it's what you got inside that counts. And I think we're one of the few industries where that really actually shows. It's what you know, not who you know. It's what you can do, not what you look like. And that's one of the best things about the games industry. So without further ado.